Welcome back to the Hollywood News Channel, where we update you with the latest news of the day. Hello, everyone, and welcome back. Best-selling author Doug Veed has revealed in his upcoming book, Inside the White House, the real story of his presidency, that the U.S. president will sometimes tease the first lady when the media is being tough on her. Although outwardly the Trumps will dutifully talk about how serving the American people is a privilege, they sometimes need to ease the tension. Mr. Wade spent two years in the White House interviewing the Trump family and has now written a book which he claims will put many rumors about the family to rest. Mr. Wade wrote in his book that the president will occasionally ease the tension by teasing the First Lady. Trump sometimes sarcastically speaks with puffed up importance to his wife when she's having a particularly tough time. On one occasion he said, Melania, honey, look at this incredible journey I have brought you on. Trump's daughter-in-law, who is married to his son Eric, has said that it's a regular joke between the couple. She said, it's like a joke between them at every dinner. Everyone is attacking all of us and she's smeared for no reason other than pure jealousy and he says, Han, isn't this amazing? This journey that I have allowed you to come on. And she's like, oh yeah, thank you so much. Mr. Wade describes the Trump's public attacks as a nightmare, he added. No first family in recent memory has gone through what they're going through. It is much worse than Donald Trump originally warned back at the family meeting in Bedminster, New Jersey. It comes as the first lady allegedly did not receive a gift from her husband last year. The president admitted how he was too busy to shop for a gift for the first lady, whose birthday falls on April 26th. During a 2018 interview with Fox and Friends, the president was asked what he had gotten his wife for her special day. Trump then paused before answering. He said, Maybe I didn't get her so much. I got her a beautiful card. You know, I'm very busy to be running looking for presents. The lifelong friend of Trump said they spent very little to no time together. It emerged the couple have very separate schedules, which includes sleeping in separate bedrooms. The President's Day reportedly kicks off with him getting up around 5.30 a.m. and watching cable news shows. Friends of the Trumps revealed Melania wakes up later in her own bedroom. Thank you so much for joining us and see you in the next video. Bye. Thank you for watching the Hollywood News. Don't forget to like and share the updates to the latest information of the day.